Hello, and welcome back to the Presidential Palace in Esthar. This is Blizzard. Why would I want that? Um, we got stuff to do. Lots of stuff to do. And we're gonna get lost doing it, frankly. Uh, Esthar is really big, and it's pretty easy to get lost. So the first thing on our to-do list, the first thing on our itinerary, is to head over here, because we need to talk to this guy. Or more specifically, we need to play cards with this guy. Uh, I don't know what same wall is. <laughs> I'd rather not do trade rule one either, but you know, I'll deal. Mm. No, I don't want to deal. I'd rather have selfie, and I'd rather have e fruit right now as well, but uh, that's not an option. Oh yeah, uh, Odine here has a rare card, so we want it, because that's what we do. That's a seven. That's a seven. Did we have addition as well, or only same? I wasn't paying attention. Uh, oh, well, I can take that. That's, uh... Oh no, no, that will definitely result in a steal. That's good. Uh, let's just, uh, before we continue. Ah. Hmm. Oh well. That'll have to do. Okay, so I do want Malboros the most, pretty much, if I'm not getting the work hard I want, but. Basically, anything that I have, like, I should take white cards over yellow cards, because it might let me remove more cards, and that's going to be important shortly. Cypher, Zell, Selfie, and these guys. Oh, okay, there's the card. It's, a, uh, it's Ward. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure I can do this safely. And, um... Cypher... You know, I could have taken Ward with Cypher. I should have done that. Yep. Can't... I mean, I can still take him, but, uh... Can I take him safely? That's another matter. Well, I could take him, but it doesn't matter. Got 
Okay, that did not take very long, which is nice. Now let's do TFO. <laughs> Um, what's over here? <laughs> Is this where I came in? I genuinely don't remember. I guess not. Or maybe it is. I just still don't know. <laughs> Whatever. We have other things to do in Eskar now. Like, so many things. Like, seriously, I cannot understate how freaking big this city is. And, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna need to walk around here. Like, it has the elevator breathing places. The... Is this an elevator, actually? It's not, is it? Whatever. It has the... These things to bring you around. The tra mass transit is what it is. But... That doesn't... We're gonna need to get find our way around the city later on without that benefit. Okay then. Hmm. Well, let's try going this way. That's interesting. I'm not sure it's particularly useful, but it's interesting. Okay. If I'm where I think I am, then this should go to the shopping district? I might not be where I think. Or thought? No, we made it! Okay. Uh... Yes, I do. Uh, pet shop. The pet shop shells, shells, sells. Uh, oh, well, let's buy one of those. Let's buy one of those. But it sells these. And also these. I wonder if I can turn these into anything. I mean, I can afford them, so why don't I buy one of each? I'm not gonna use them on a GF, but maybe I can do something else with them. Rin Rin's Pet Store. Cloud's sh Item Shop. I can buy Demolition Ammo, which is nice, but I already have all of it that I need. And AP Ammo's better, actually, anyway. Okay, so there's a reason I'm doing this right here, uh, which will come up later. Possibly, possibly a few hours later, but it will come up. Shop is closed. We're having a sale! Okay, uh, I'm actually really close to being able to do this. I only need the pulse ammo. I can do this, but not this. Um, I don't have enough dragon skin, so I think I'll hold back on that one. I need a star fragment. Uh, Malboro tentacles and energy crystals. We will get energy crystals at the end of the disc, which are also what we need for the pulse ammo, actually. Um, I need a regen ring and energy crystals. I need a star fragments. I'm not 100%, I don't remember where we get star fragments from, unfortunately. Uh, no, I want to shop at the bookstore. Because they sell all of the books. Including all of the Comic Kings that I've been ignoring. Oh! Huh. 
I didn't know they sold occult fans as well. Maybe that's a tomb berry bonus. It might be. Shop is closed for today. Please come tomorrow. Uh, can I, uh, there we are. So, let's take a look at some of that stuff we just bought. Item hunting sounds like a daunting task, but it's true that you need items to do anything. So, let's have your dog learn another trick. It's Angelo Search. Your dog finds items while you are fighting. Be sure to praise your dog while... I mean, it's Angela, so while he finds an item. Have you ever wanted to achieve a goal together with your pet? Make it come true using Wishing Star. Attack enemies together. The power of love multiplies your power by 10 to 20 times to defeat your enemies. Try it. You'll like it. Do you guys know what a dolphin is? It's an adorable great mammal that lives in the ocean. This skill, called Dolphin Blow, draws out the secret power of the dolphin. It'll give the enemy a hell of a show! Man, I can't... I can't read that. <laughs> As a fighter, you will occasionally encounter near-death experiences using Meteor Brett. In these situations, it may be your only chance to emerge victorious. It is a skill that throws your enemy energy against the enemy. Being a finishing blow, it inflicts tremendous damage against the enemy. Remember, always use it for a good cause. The enemy can't do anything if you lift them up in the air with a different beat. You can kick the enemy up in the air and keep kicking them while they remain completely defenseless. This is really an efficient skill, so it's worthwhile to get it down. I mean, Let's put it this way, it's a good thing that the two button combos are actually the best way to use Zell's Limit, because I cannot read any of the damn combos. Veloc- uh, Apparently, if you increase the velocity, the energy goes up! This skill is based on this physics equation. At a velocity near the speed of light, you can do major damage! Get this skill, my final heaven! Down and check out the high-speed thrashing! Remember, always use it for a good cause, okay? Odell Burke of Timber was tending to his field when he found a dead monster after hearing a loud impact. Mr. Burke said it occurred while he was making a fence with steel pipes. An extremely strange death. An unidentified flying object. On the left is the photo shot in Esthar. Take a look at the unidentified flying object in the center. Have you ever seen any monster or airplane like this? <clears throat> Some say it may be Esthar's secret weapon, but residents of the area say it appears when there's a major Marlboro outbreak. Cool. Uh, I feel like did I did I miss a combat king? We're gonna just, uh, quickly double check. Uh, no, I already had number two. Okay. I only had one combat king. <laughs> Terrific. Okay, uh, that is a spell that I wanted. Is there, uh, oh. Hmm. There is one other spell that I really want, but I'm not sure if I can pick it up yet. Also, uh, just just for point of reference, we could have actually found Combat King number four, which we just bought somewhere in the city, but uh, we didn't. We just bought it. It's it's easier this way. Okay. Um. There's one more stop I'm gonna make before we call this an episode. Uh, I'm just, I'm just not sure if this will work. Uh, we'll see. Don't care about Quake, but I want to go inside. No. Okay. Yeah. It'll have to wait. Cause there's a draw point in there that I want. 
But, uh, it seems we will not be doing that today. So, uh, given that's the case, I, uh, think we can stop off here. Join me... Wait, who's in my party? Ha. Huh. Yeah, okay. Uh, join me next time. When we do stuff and things. Next time. Uh, oh, actually, wait, no. Sorry, there's actually one thing I need to address really quickly here. Namely, uh, Alexandra is learning this, right? But it's actually really desperately important that I get med data, which is quite expensive because I need the ability that I get for having med data. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need that, and I'm gonna need it, like, relatively soon. Fortunately, that's- it sort of lines up with when I'm gonna be level grinding anyway. Uh, but, yeah. Uh, oh, well, my level went down. Oh, well. Uh, having- having dealt with that, uh, now we are done. Join me next time when we do stuff in the- outside of Esthar. Well, outside with air quotes. Not in the city proper, but we'll- we'll still be in there. So, uh, until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy Kiss Blue, and uh, have a great day. Bye!